Okay, we are discussing uh, wave chapter of class 11th. So far, you have discussed the relation uh, of displacement, displacement relation for a plane progressive wave. So, in the continuation, today we will discuss principle of superposition of waves. Statement uh, we will discuss first of all <clears throat> when two or more waves pass through the same medium at the same time the net displacement at any point is equal to the vector sum of their individual displacements at that point mathematically you can write y is equal to y1 plus y2 plus y3 dash 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 plus up to yn so in the diagram you are clearly observing here uh, the crest of one wave lies on crest and trough of uh, one wave lies on the trough of other wave. So because of this the resultant uh, displacement is equal to the sum of their individual displacements. So we will get a constructive interference here. Similarly when uh, crest of one wave lies on trough of another wave then what happens the resultant amplitude the amplitude of the resultant wave decreases and it comes out to be y is equal to y1 minus y2 so you will get destructive interference of waves here okay so what is the conclusion of this superposition principle conclusion is that if crest of one wave falls on crest and trough falls on trough then constructive interference is obtained means the resultant displacement of the wave resultant wave increases Whereas if crest lies on trough then the resultant displacement of the resultant wave decreases and it comes out to be y is equal to y1 minus y2. So here we have the three consequences of the principle of superposition of wave. Number one interference of wave. First is interference of wave. Actually in case of interference when two or when two waves of the same frequency which are moving with the same speed in the same direction in a medium superimpose on each other then they give rise to the effect which is known as interference of waves. Okay, In case of stationary waves two waves which have the same frequency and moving with the same speed but in opposite direction here important thing is the direction is opposite then they superpose on each other then they produce stationary waves in case of beats if you have two waves which are little bit different which which are little bit different slightly different frequencies and moving with the same speed in the same direction in a medium they superimpose on each other then they produce beat so these are the three effects interference 